Well, hello, and here we are again. It's been a little while longer than I thought it was going to be, but here we are playing The Escapists Alpha 0 0.753. Uh, this is the one that's on uh, Steam at the moment. It's available for everyone in early access, and I haven't actually loaded it up beyond this screen yet, so let's give it a go, shall we? Okay, so. Actually, that one looks a little bit like me. We'll stay with that one. Okay, thinking of names. Names are always difficult. Names always have possibilities. I've been naming my characters in this game after successful fictional escapees, but I thought I'd do one a little bit different this time. Meet Charlie Croker. He didn't break out of a prison. He broke into one. So, we have First Peak Correctional and First Peak Correctional at the moment. So, I'll tell you what. Let's do first peak correctional. Talking to other inmates raises their opinion of you. Oh, this is looking better. Dear Charlie, welcome to prison. First peak correctional is a brand new state of the art facility designed with your discomfort in mind. All of our staff are highly trained to make sure your stay here is a truly unpleasant one. You've got a long sentence ahead, so make yourself at home and don't even think about escaping. Signed, Warden Dean Hall. Okay, so here we are. Got all of the, the same things we had before. We got a bed, we got a toilet, we got a keyboard. Prison life is all about routines. By sticking to them, you'll keep your guards off your back while you put together your escape plan. Okay, let's just quickly F1. Where's the keys to move? Space to toggle combat mode. Left mouse to interact target, use and move items. Right mouse to pick it up and drop to view profiles, alternate Q and E to work out, use Q to recruit and dismiss buddies. Well, that one's new. Okay, let's get to roll call before we get beaten up. Music's better. Music's very different. Alright, line up you maggots. Ooh, you can see weapons now. So, nothing to sell, stats, no. Right, find me a roll of toilet paper and I'll make it worth your while. Okay. Taylor, what do you got to sell? Wire, a hammer, stepladder, stepladder. Not much use to me at the moment, but still. Let's have a quick look here. Steve. Hello, Steve. Armed with a hammer. And what have you got? Somehow, Louis got his grubby paws on my bar of chocolate. I need it back. Okay. There we go. A couple of jobs. So, load, crafting, journal. What's our journal say? Roll it, toilet paper for Levi. Retrieve Steve's a bar of chocolate for Louis. We have no craft notes at the moment. And our profile. We're doing laundry. We don't have a weapon. 29, 29, 29. So, not very good stats. Okay. Looks like the time is uh, slowed down a little bit, the passage of time, and I think that's good, to be honest with you. Because, quite honestly, it was a little bit chaotic at the start. Where are we going? Oh, right, okay. Food there. And there's a couple of seats left here, so let's sit there. Right. Crafting note in the kitchens there. I tell you what, the graphics have distinctly improved, haven't they? Max, what do you got up to? Um, nothing to sell. You ain't got time to chat. Have you got? Have you got time to chat? No. Okay. All right. So it doesn't look like we can talk to them while they're sat down again. Okay. All right. Off to the laundry. Which should be fun. I haven't got the faintest idea where the laundry is. Let's find it, shall we? Employment officer. Oh, right. Job board. Oh, we're here. Let's have a look. So, we got kitchen now. Excellent. No vacant. Uh, I see. I see. I see. I see. If I want a job, I've got to stop somebody from working at it. Interesting. Visitation rooms. Solitary. What's this? Infirmary. Okay, there's the cells. Hidden crafting note there. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's a dead end. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Okay, those are cells as well. Library, outside. Solitary, solitary. I think I'm going to be applying for this job again. Is it down here? Showers. Ooh, I seem to have walked past it. Oh, there's the little. Ooh. <laughs> All right. Six minutes in. Got beaten up already. That sounds about right for this game, doesn't it? Okay, let's go and. Let's see if I can find the laundry. I think I saw the laundry just before I got beaten up, which was very useful. Is that the laundry? That's the kitchen. Oh, this is going well, isn't it, boys and girls? Oh, dear. What about out here? What are these? Payphones. Ah, there has been an arrow pointing the way all this time. Of course there's been an arrow pointing this way all the time. Why wouldn't there be an arrow point, uh, pointing the way all this time? I mean, come on. Well, at least I'll... Be oh dear. Due to your sheer incompetence and inability to reach the quotas we've set, we've taken away your laundry job. If you pull yourself together and decide to try harder in the future, you may reapply to the, the, the job board and the prison offices. Well, now I know where it is. That'll be easier. Now I, I remember there's this great yellow arrow which was floating in the middle of the screen, pointing the way, and I totally didn't notice. Hello. Nice. Um, perhaps now I might actually be able to do the job. Hey, if you could direct the, the guard's attention next shower period for me, I can dish out some justice using this screwdriver. Okay, see if I can actually remember that. Then this doesn't. Find me a toothbrush and I'll make it worth your while. Okay. And what are you guys selling? Sheet metal, wire, step ladder. I don't need any of that at the moment. Don't have any money either. Mags, foil, foil's a new one. I wonder what that's used for. We'll find out. And have I got the wrong person there? Aiden, who's unemployed. There's a bag of cement, a baton, a wire, and a lighter. Okay, well. Expecting today to be a bit of a disaster, to be honest with you. But now I have a bit of a better idea of the uh, layout of the prison. Actually, when I'm thinking about it. Let's go and apply for that job again. Can I talk to you? No, I can't. Okay. Right. Do I want to work metal shop or do I want to work laundry? I want to work metal shop. Let's work for metal shop. Apply. You need at least 70 intellect to apply for that job. So your application has been declined and filed neatly away down my toilet. Spend some time in the library and smarten up, boy. I do like his humor. Let's work in the laundry. Uh, you need at least 30 intellect to apply for the job. So, okay. Looks like our next target is going to be the library. But let's have a little walk around first and see what this prison's like. So, usual deal with the walls. There's a gate there. Okay, this is the front entrance, obviously. Okay. We have the gym here. Showers, that's the kitchen. I don't know what this room is. Oh, hide, cleaning. Okay, so looks like cleaning might be a job some in the future. There's the library. We can stare at the bookshelves. In fact, let's stare at the bookshelves a little bit. Why not? Okay, stared at the bookshelves. Got some intelligence. Stared at the bookshelves some more. Got some more intelligence. How much intelligence have we got? 28. It goes down fast in this game. Okay, a couple more. Now, is this only going up by a point now? This is only going up by a point now. Okay. So, let's do a couple more. There you go, one more. Right, let's go and apply for that job, shall we? And then, if we have time, we'll have... Well, I don't think we're going to have time, but later on we'll have a look out the other gates. Dinner time. Alright, apply for job. 
Laundry, apply. Okay. We're now working in the laundry. Let's go get some food. Let's go. The brown slop is still here, I see. So glad. It would be really disappointing if there was something other than brown slop. Because, let's face it, brown slop is what defines the prison experience. Hmm. I'm liking the music. Yeah. I think a lot of work has gone into this since, uh, since the early alphas. Exercise period. Let's go and exercise for a little bit. Let's do some weights. Okay. Um, you know, I've got to be honest, the early alpha was a, a, a pretty solid game, all told. Um, there were some flaws. It was possible to break out in five minutes. It took me 16 episodes to notice it was possible to break out in five minutes, but it was still possible to break out in five minutes. God, that was embarrassing. That's, uh, I mean, I like the look of this one. The graphics are nicer. There's a few options. Can't talk and press Q and E repeatedly at the same time. I seem to have lost that skill. Oh dear. Ah, come on, one more. Oh, oh, okay, let's go and have a shower instead. Yeah, the graphics look much better. There's been a bit of work on the on the music. Seems to be a little bit less um, generalized violence floating around. Um, I am wondering who's going to be this season's Pierre. What are these? These are greats, aren't they? Hmm, I wonder if I... Uh, I wonder. Hmm, perhaps try a file on one of those. It'd be interesting if this, is, this has got sewers now as well, wouldn't it? Okay. Hmm, right, what do we want? We want to go out the bottom this time. Have a look around down here. Still wondering what these are. Pay phones. Can't use them. Still, interesting addition. And there's the woodworking room. Oh, they fixed that bug. That looks like those washing machines were emptied. That's a shame. Uh, lockers to hide in. There's the warden's quarters, uh, the, the guard's quarters by the looks of it. There's your metalwork room. I have to get an idea of the guards' patterns because we still have these nicely fileable through fences here. Generator? Ooh, generator. Now that's interesting. Hmm. Hmm. And, and hmm. Again, to be honest with you, I'm intrigued. Ah, it's, it seems like a, an observation of the guards' patterns would not be a bad idea. I mean, there's people walking around out here but not that much there's guards on patrol but I wonder would they see me here yeah perhaps if I was to file through here and then I could be looking at going over the wall hmm interesting there's an option I could always dig another hole I quite enjoy digging holes I could, what else can I do? I can, oh, there's, there's one. Um, let's have a quick shifty through the desk, shall we? It's a bit of a tradition, if nothing else, isn't it? Alright, I wanted some toilet paper, didn't I? And is there anything else I'm interested in here? Toothpaste and comb. There we go. Now, who wanted stuff? Um, Levi and Max. So let's see how long my short term memory can keep that. What do you. Um, bar of chocolate, bar of chocolate. Uh, let's grab it anyway. Alright, so Levi and Max. That's where are you guys? Joseph, Aiden, Levi. Hello, Levi. Alright, uh. What did you want? Um, toilet paper for Levi. 
give. Give. Okay, and Max, where are you, matey? Um, Marcus, Louis, Taylor. Still like standing on top of each other, don't they? Roll, Marcus. I missed him. Yeah, well, he doesn't appear to be here, does he? Alright, never mind. I will give that to him tomorrow. Which one sells mine? That's my desk. Can I climb on it still? Yep, and joy of joys, there are gratings over the top of us. Alright, let's sleep. And we'll do another day tomorrow, perhaps being slightly more organised. Okay, it's his morning. Let's just get rid of that last bit of fatigue. Do roll call. Actually, just quickly look in here. I think we'll have that. Um, just to have one with me in case I want a weapon. Alright, let's see if we can find Max this time round. Martin, William, Michael, Shreva, Louis, Adam, Joseph. This is fascinating stuff, isn't it? Taylor, Max. Hello, Max. Got something for you, Max. Have a comb. Oh, you wanted a toothbrush, didn't you? Alright, never mind. Alright, uh, let's just check. Toothbrush. Steve's bar of chocolate from Louis. So let's have a chance. When we have the chance, we'll have a look for Louis's desk. And we're still looking for a toothbrush. Whew. How I got those two mixed up, I don't know. Someone who's been tampering with the warden's toupee. Right, let's grab some. Oh, it's my favourite! Brown slot. Well, actually, while I'm thinking about it, utensils. Good, these are still... These are still valid items. Okay, that's... Uh, Sit down, enjoy uh, what passes for our breakfast, and then we'll go off and do the laundry and see if we can get it right this time. Days seem to be slightly longer, which does actually make me feel that time is flowing a little bit slower. Which is good. I, I did think that the first alpha of this I played was way too fast. The other one I think I got used to. But uh, slowing it down a little, giving people a little bit more time is great. I think the breakfasts and the showers are going to be a bit slow. There's not much you can do here. But still, not bad at all. Let's go and do some laundry, shall we? Which reminds me, I need to put mine on. Oh, dear. Here we go. Right, let's just drop this junk off. Why can't I drop, drop stuff? Right, okay. Not going to waste time. Let's get uh, our quota done a little bit at least. No, don't dig. Oh dear. God, that could have been bad. So I can work out how to do this, how to drop stuff. I'm not entirely certain why it's not. Okay, now four. Click four. Right click four. Click. Ah. Oh, I used it. All right, that'll do just as well. Okay. Yeah, I might still do this today. go right that's that uh, that's the job quota done got myself a bit of money let's put another set in while we're thinking about it and that will speed up tomorrow for us five and six there we go all right let's leave that so did you finish spuds quest or what still playing that actually it's a good game Right, what should we do? Um, let's repeat. Oh, okay. Let's do nothing and but go to midday roll call. How about that? That's a good idea. 
Alright, yesterday my bottle of medicine vanished. Uh, no, I'm not going to bother with an officer just yet. Alright, what can my $59 buy me? Steve, what you got to sell? A crafting note. Well, that's a good start. A med kit. Ooh, interesting. A flashlight and a bag of cement. Right, let's have a crafting note. Let's start off with one of those. And Michael, what have you got to sell? A file and a guard outfit. Don't need any of that just yet. Right. A candle, battery wire. Okay. Nothing new there, but I did actually find they were a bit useless, to be honest with you. Uh, underground, it seemed that uh, it was light enough to see, and yeah, it wasn't really that much use, but I, it does actually look a bit darker now, so uh, perhaps uh, the lighting is useful. Afternoon free period. Do you know what? I think I'm going to have a little snoop around, see if I can find a toothbrush. Um, no, 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 no. Okay, what about in Ronald's desk? Ronald, we remember fondly from the last game. Oh, super glue and toilet paper. Excellent. That's all good stuff. Okay, let's get out of here before a guard sees me. Let's read that crafting note. Contraband pouch. Well, I wonder what that is. Foil and duct tape. Nice. Just make sure that the crafting notes. Yeah, we go. Steve, how you doing, mate? What you got? You got anything fun? You haven't got anything fun. What about you, Marcus? What do you got? Nothing. Good lord, these guys are boring. What sort of criminal masterminds are you? Well, apart from ones that got caught, that is. Oh, that's any good. Yeah, I didn't think that one was worth searching. I know there's nothing in there. Louis, what do you got? Nout. That just leaves us with William. And you're just as boring, aren't you, William? Okay, let's stash some of this stuff. Toilet paper and super glue are oh, great. That makes some paper mache. Let's store that spoon just in case I try to dig another hole in the ground. And this toothpaste and talcum powder, if I remember right, makes. Um, putty and putty is used for making key impressions. Right, that's not a bad haul actually. Okay, let's do a little bit of exercise. Let's work on our speed a touch. Right, so we're, we're it's well we're over 20 minutes now, so what I will do is I will stop at the end of today, and it looks like my standard 30 minute episode is going to be two days now it used to be three days so you know things are going to be going a little bit slower but we'll try to fill them up with interesting or stupid or stupidly interesting things one or the other or both anyone who's watched the first series of this knows that i'm very good at stupidly interesting it seems to be a talent of mine to be honest with you one thing i do miss minus fat if you don't know what i'm talking about watch the last series I really did love sitting down for lunch and seeing a little sign going up over my head saying minus fat. Just good. Just enjoying the music. So what do you think we should do? Okay, what do you think we should do? How do you think we should break out this time? We've tunneled out. We've what have we done? We filed, we filed a hole out through the fence. We got up onto the roof a couple of times and instantly, instantly got seen by the searchlights. Um, I'm just going to assume that the guards had the clever idea of saying, well, look, why don't we just shine a light at this trapdoor? Then we can see when people come out of it. It makes a lot of sense, really, doesn't it? Still, very frustrating. So come on, what do you think guys? Give us some comments, give us some thoughts. Under, over, or through. Um, something else I'd like to try is get hold of a guard outfit and see if, um, if that'll let me go places where I shouldn't. 
but uh, unfortunately in the last series the guards outfits were completely useless you couldn't even wear them which is a shame oh I've just noticed there isn't a metal detector here interesting that means I can buy me contraband in the shower how nice doing three time what should we do let's have a oh, I'll tell you what let's have a quick look at our, our stats for a sec okay so we got some strength we're losing out on speed and we're losing out on intellect okay let's get intellect over to over 30 it's a bit boring but it seems to be absolutely essential for crafting crafting is really central to this game so it does strike me that a lot of our spare time is going to have to be devoted to exercising, to reading, to things like that. Otherwise, we're just not going to be able to make it anywhere. It certainly is easier to play this game with high stats. You move faster, you have more hit points, you can craft more things. How are we doing? 31. Okay, let's get this up um, as high as we can. Okay, we've got another hour. So we'll probably let's get this up to 40 and then we'll go off and work on our speed. And that will allow us to actually do some more different recipes, to explore different options, perhaps get a better job later on if we can get into intellect high enough. How are we doing? 39. One more. In fact, that was probably the one more, but that'll do anyway. And we're pretty exhausted, but let's do a little bit more working out here. I think we're nearly at uh, evening roll call anyway, so... Working on speed, unfortunately, is the hardest one to do. Um, you know... Oh, too fatigued. Okay, that's it. Let's see what we can do. Let's take a, a quick look in a few cells, see if we can find anything interesting. I wonder if those cameras work now. Adam. Hello, Adam. You got anything fun? Battery, not particularly interested at the moment. Oh, let's have it anyway. Uh, off you go, Mr. Guard. Thank you very much. Oh, fatigue seems to be going down on its own, if you're, as long as you're not actually doing anything anymore. Pack of mints. Oh, very nice. I think we'll have some of those. Bottle of medicine and a razor blade. None of it I need, actually need at the moment, but what the heck. Aiden. Hiding anything fun? Oh, talcum powder. Have some of that. Thank you very much. Um, we're nearly at the evening roll call, I think. It's just time to have a look in Trevor's desk. Nothing fun there. Right, off to roll call. Just remind myself quickly while we're here of the tasks. Toothbrush and Stephen's bar of chocolate from Louis. We haven't found Louis's desk yet, I think. Might have to beat up Louis. Pack of mints. I wonder what you can use those for. Well, I, I can think of one use for them. I wonder what else you can do with them. I'm very interested in this contraband pouch as well. That seems like a, you know, possibly hide items away type thing. If with one of those you can have something that's illegal in your desk and nobody's going to see it. Your family have disowned you. Hmm. Right. I do like the colouring. I do. It's become much darker, which is yeah, much more pleasant. Okay, so don't need the razor blade at the moment. Don't need that at the moment. Don't need that at the moment. Don't need that at the moment. We... Uh, can take one of those and we can craft those can't we crafting uh, one of them one of them what a putty oh what's a putty and now oh that's now contraband Ooh, interesting have to get rid of that then I think tell you what let's see if we can flood let's see if we can flood Come on, how do we just... There we go. Flush. Are we going to flood the area? No, we're not going to flood the area. That's disappointing. Well, is there anything else we can do here quickly? Well, we can make paper mache. But 
I don't need it just yet. Can't use the bottle of medicine for anything. Don't really need a torch, but I've got to be honest with you. With the new lighting, I'm going to think that might be worth trying. So let's just go to bed. So there we go. That was episode one. I hope you enjoyed it. I certainly did. It's so nice to be playing this game again. I'll just pause it there. And I'll say thank you very much, guys. Um, please leave a comment. Please leave a like. Please subscribe if you wish to. I've been Simon Parsons. And this has been The Escapists Series 2. Thank you and good night.